<laughs> what is going on, everybody? Depraved Slasher here. We are back with another music reaction. I'm Depraved. I'm Hellcat. And together we are... Hello, Depraved. Yes, we are. And boy, do we have a doozy. Now, we are extremely late on this. Usually on Saturdays, we jump right on ERBs. Um, we had some other stuff going on. But yeah, we were moving. That's why we're down here. At least partially. Yeah. Um, and then Sunday was Spider-Man Day. And then... We're here. And Marvel Podcast Day. And we're here. And today's Monday, so we're here to recording this for Tuesday. Um, I'm excited for this, but to be honest, I'm only excited for it because it's ERB. <laughs> you have given me literally three characters I don't give a fuck about. Now, I do like the diehards. At least enough to have seen them multiple times. We've only seen the first John Wick. And unless they come on a free platform, we'll not plan on seeing the rest of them. Um, and I haven't seen Rambo in an eon. So, here's the thing. If there's any of these I care most about, it's Rambo. Okay. I didn't like the Die Hard movies. I know. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a heathen. Fuck ever. Um... And I will sit here and die on the hill. It is not a Christmas movie. I don't care. <laughs> the setting does not make the movie. Well. Um, however, John Wick, the first one was okay. Yeah, I wasn't, it, it, look, it was a good movie. I, it just wasn't better than... Yeah, I, I, Jason Bourne yeah, J in terms Jason of Jason Bourne should be in this. And but. and I think that's but I think that's the thing is like everyone had hyped it up to be the best assassin movie to have come out and he could do this and that and the other and both of us were watching it and we're like, "Okay, but there's none of the character development, there's none of the cool actual intricate story like Bourne." Now, again, that's basing our well, judgment off of the, the first movie. And then my complaint, personally, just falls on Keanu Reeves as an actor. I don't mind Keanu as an actor. Right. When he plays a role that fits him, to me, roles like Bill and Ted fit him. Reason being, he always looks dumb and confused. That is his facial look. So when he's sitting here as an assassin, beating the shit out of everybody, but one looks like he's wondering why he's there... <laughs> You're throws like, me completely sweet boy. off. Poor sweet. Um, to me, he just looks very sedate. I like Keanu. I like him as a person. Oh, a he's lot. a great person. Um, and I like several movies that he's in and his role in them. Point Break being one of them. But again, it's he just sort of has a kind of sedate look. I I actually don't necessarily mind him as an assassin because again. Well, it's one of those like low key, low emotion. What's, well, what's funny though is so I do like all these the actors that these characters are based off of. Right. As, as far as like actors go, I just like them in other things. Other things, yeah. Okay. Um, but anyways, right. we're here for it. We'll try and call out whatever bars we may catch. Right. I mean, that's that's the thing is, it's it's been a while for two of the movies and one of them, like we said, we've only seen one. So. Right. So, with that being said, we're going to react to this if you guys have already seen it. If not, click the link in the description below. Hop on over to all the things. Come on back. And we said that because we're a commentary reaction breakdown comedy channel. And what that means is we will pause for any and all of the above. So, with that being said, it is time to slash it down and break it down. This is ERB with John Wick versus John, John Rambo versus John, John McClane. Yeah. Let's get it. What the fuck? What is the John Wick! <laughs> Morrison! John McLean! Morrison! John Rambo! Begin! Alright, guess I'll be the one to draw first. Thank you! Nice. Thank you! They got his voice. Alright. <laughs> Sorry. That was fabulous. That also, a good way to start it off. I'll be the, first, the one to draw first blood. Nice. John Rambo! Begin! Alright. Guess I'll be the one to draw first blood. Or maybe you could draw an audience to see any of your new movies. Come out to the coast, we'll have a few laughs. Sounds sweet, but no. Oh, <laughs> dear God. 
All right, so Wick already pretty much saying that Sylvester Stallone doesn't get people to watch his movies. Anymore, at least. Anymore. Yeah. Um, to be fair, most of us don't go to theaters to watch movies anyways. Yeah, but also, Unless it's you know, some actors... As they get older, they don't act as well. Well, especially in the roles that they were sort of typecast for originally. Right. That's just the way it is. To see any of your new movies. Come out to the coast, we'll have a few laughs. Sounds sweet, but no, I'm stuck here with these two jerkweeds about to kick their ass with bare feet. I got to drop the beat. I'll set it off against the top of Nakatomi. Need a fire hose to swing on you, you boat so below me. I haven't stopped killing it since calls for the Tony, and I got your detonators right here. Blow me. Uh. All right, I mean, he is, he is a wise ass in all of the Die Hards, actually in quite a few of his movies, but... Right. Nakatomi, wasn't that the um, dude that he takes on in the first one? I'm I'm pretty sure it was the name of. Um... I've seen it once. Oh. Fifteen twenty years ago. Pretty sure. I could be wrong, guys, but I'm pretty sure that was the name of the corporation, person, whatever. Stop killing it, it's cause for the Tony, and I got your detonators right here. Blow me. Oops. Ship your booby traps home, Rambo. Cause you'll never take the W without the P&O. Does your lip hang low? Does it wobble to and fro? Can you string <laughs> that shit up on your compound bow? Like and he used that the Christmas cute. reference. Mm. Oh, that was cute. I fucking hate that. Anyways. Well, and what? So Tony and Carl were, he killed the brother. And that's why Carl was coming after him the first time in Die Hard. Right. The, the first one. And then he just said, um, shoot, whatever. I But I did like the do your ears hang low, do they wobble to and fro reference. It's a fun little nursery rhyme. It is. It is. Makes no sense, but very cute. Right. Well, it does. Because rent... Sylvester Stallone always kind of had that draw. No, I meant the original. Oh! The original nursery rhyme. Oh. No, the way that they used it made perfect sense. Okay. No, uh, the original. Do, do your ears hang low? Right. Will we trapped home, Rambo? Because you'll never take the W without the P&O. Does your lip hang That's low? That's what I Does meant. Does it wobble to it, bro? Can you string that shit up on your compound bow? Lighten up, Wick, with your brooding saga. How about a little Akuna Matata, Bobby? You got the trousers. <laughs> Hakuna Statas. That's fabulous. It was the, uh, you'll never take the W without the piano. Prisoner of War. Rambo. There you go. Um, Light up your wick. I, 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 I like your being, being calling him uh, Baba, Baba Yaga. Yaga. That's what everybody refers to him as. Which I never understood that because the Baba Yaga's... She's a witch that lives in a hut on chicken feet and eats kids. Right. Yeah. Yeah. With your brooding saga. How about a little Akuna Matata, Baba Yaga? You got the trousers, tape, and the watch. Spooker. But your acting falls flatter than the hot. Gruber. Leave the underground point. Okay. All right. So, you know, we're not the only ones with the same opinion. Uh... Fabulous human being. And honestly, he can act. Just dumb. Sedate. I don't know if dumb is necessarily the word. It's just like reserved. Like, it, um, I don't see much emotion from him. Like, I, I don't know. There's just not a whole swing in the range of emotions from him, I guess is what I'm saying. You know, if you're an assassin, may as well be Sorry. unemotional, right? I mean, like, like that yeah. seems like it would be the better type of person. Unemotional, yes. Yes. But you can at least still look focused. Which is your problem, right? He looks unfocused. Like, why am I here? Uh, 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 Possibly. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, okay. Like, come on, dude. 
watch. Booker. But your acting falls flatter than the hot. Gruber. With the underground coin game, the Mario Brothers. And John Booby. What the fuck's with the chest butter? The bandolier looks heavy as shit. I'm like this prick's ring finger, only need one clip. Ah. Have a shot for shattered glass. Too soon. Never. So Never. I fucking hate that part as a plot in the movie. So dumb. Right, well, that that was... Oh, you killed my dog. Taking shots. It's the last thing my wife got me. Okay, <laughs> yeah. I... My main problem with that, main problem being the you amount of bonding time. Hours? Less the amount of bonding time it, granted, like, if you got something that was an inanimate object and it got shattered, say, within 24 hours of that person's passing, would it be an emotional problem? Absolutely. But would it be this killing rampage? Probably not. Although, don't kill animals. Yeah, just don't. So, I, I don't know. I, I, I just, that was my other problem with John Wick movies. Yeah. Heavy as shit. I'm like this prick's ring finger. Only need one clip. God, I've been shopping shattered glass since the late '80s. And like your late pump, I'll leave you pushing up daisies. Less is oh. more, boys. That's my advice. You less survival knife. You more survival wife. Yo. Right. I'm He's okay. I'm rooting for. Shots. I'm rooting for John here. He's did. That was so daisy. No matter what, the I'm name of the dog John, for anyone but... that uh, you're like, I'm voting for John. Nice. Nice. McLean. McLean's got the win for me so okay. far. Okay. Well, he's also been the only one to rap. I know. Throwing shots at this point. Yeah. Yeah. I like the body butter part because honestly, that is a main complaint that I had with the um, sort of '80s action flick. They all look like GI Joe. It, you've got Arnold, and you've got uh, the chopper. Right, but they're all lubed up. You're like, really? Was that necessary? Always. Yes. Unless, Very unless necessary. you're lubed up with mud because you're hiding from an alien creature that's trying to kill you. Well, then you look matte. You know, so <laughs> we're going. <laughs> but yeah, nice call out. Nice call out. I like out. that. I was trying to turn me and I turned you instead. All right. <sighs> Boys, that's my advice. You less survival knife, you more survival wife. Ooh. I'm going to need a dinner reservation for two. John Wick, I'm efficient and lean, a proficient professional killing machine, underworld overachiever looking dapper as a buck and only one of us to go three chapters without sucking. Between your elevator and the mine where you were trapped, you're such wieners I should call you both John Shaft. I craft rhymes with pencils then jam them in next, so I'm not vexed by vets flexing roid injected pecs. Being excommunicado wasn't more than I could handle, so I think I can withstand an excremental ex-commando and this sad broken dad joke at Popo is no foe for the hurt you oh so bad. Virtuoso, ho 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 to quivers and bows. I'm delivering blows, and when they land, it won't help to make fists with your toes. Bitcoin, no. Hitcoin, certainly. I'll put you two in two. Call it cryptocurrency. Obey your superior, like good cops and soldiers. Raven. He's got some good basic bars. He's not coming with any punches that are impressive. Nothing Imagine hurts that. at this point. Nothing hurts at this point. Right. I know the pencil scene was one of the ones that everyone was just raving about. I'd already seen Joker do it. Yeah, but also, Bourne does it. I mean, within... So, when he can't even remember that he is a hitman, he has stuck that pen all the way down that dude's knuckles within the very first... Like, when he's in his, his flat in Paris and is just trying to figure out who he is, that's when he, he like... And then takes it back out and so guys, it's been done. It's been done. Uh, but the Bitcoin versus the hit coin, because he gets the the coins and the dinner reservation for two. Right. I mean, yes, basic bars that reference his movies plus the um, punches with your toes. That was what that was a Rambo thing. I so but nothing I, I mean dad jokes and everything, I mean but that could be said about a lot of characters. Well, that, that's that's never been a problem in rap battles or ERB in general. No, he was saying that. Uh, um, uh, he's just not coming John with any McClane punches character. that are 
Does it hurt? Uh huh. Like cryptocurrency. Obey your superior. Like good cops and soldiers. Raven, Roy, you're done. Over. Nothing is over. That was it. Nothing. You just don't turn it off. <laughs> I love the music change. It and became like this segue into this emotional. Let's talk about our trauma type. That's fantastic. Nothing is over. Nothing. You just Sad don't face. It's <laughs> one of your movies. You in case. I just turn it off. <gasps> when I rip off my shirt and start swinging my dick sword, I'm hotter than the suicide girls on your switchboard. <laughs> I'll finish you right in the lobby. This didn't come. The clay! South is where your marriage went. The last pipe thing you slid in was an air vent. They used to say you were a handsome crusader. Too bad your hairline couldn't get saved by Steve Urkel's neighbor. Oh, I slip into the jungle, disappear like a gulf. That thing, I pop up hot behind you like pussy. I'm no. but I'm packing Parabella. I was trying to be the very best soldier boy. Tell I'm blessing on PG through NYPD's guts. Simon says you can PTSD. Christ, asshole! <laughs> that might have been the best goofy verse ever. What the fuck? That was hilarious. Um, what the fuck? Again, a lot of basic references to the movies. Uh, the last tight thing you slid through was this an air vent. Uh, I did like how he said, like, I would have ended it all in the lobby, though. Like, no need to climb around this high-rise building. No. Come on now. Although, because all he does is he stands in the middle of the jungle, right, and then he disappears. <laughs> and you just see people falling out of fucking trees, right? And fucking. Although, again, that classic scene of John McClane <coughs> dropping the dude and the yippee kaye motherfucker, come on, and Alan Rickman, Alan Rickman, classic villain, classic. Rest in peace. That, 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 that man, in that man was acting done right. Okay, if you want to know acting versus Keanu Reeves, go watch anything Alan Rickman. That's what we're talking about. So anyway, that was funny. That was very funny. But I don't feel like it delivered like McLean's first verse. Right. He's got Simon says you can PTSD. Jesus Christ, asshole! What are you doing? This is not some Saturday morning cartoon for you to ruin. Only thing getting ruined is McLean family Christmas. All your kids still have decent dad on their wish list. Whoa! Oh. Okay, that one hurt. Whoa! That one hurt. <laughs> He's not wrong though. He's not wrong. Bro, that's fucked up. Clay family Christmas. All your kids still have decent dad on their wish list. Whoa, Rambo dropping bombs in his flows. Your pals in the Taliban help you write those. Those were Mujahideen. There's a difference. The Taliban formed in the 90s when you fell off with a vengeance. Hey, who the fuck asked you? Die hard with a vengeance. Right. Bruh. When you fell off with a vengeance. Yeah. Uh, I mean, like, to be fair, Die here. Hard didn't need, like, four, five. I think it's four. Didn't need him. A lot of movies don't. Um, right. I forget, okay, because, again, we've only seen the first Wick and only once. Was he supposed to be super intelligent? I mean, I... It, it, it's just... So, what I will give Wick's verse, the full one that he did, the alliteration... Was the fantastic. Yeah, the flow... Um, just, I mean, the word choice, everything, but it made him so sound very analytical and very intelligent. Now, as a hitman, he'd have to be analytical. But I don't remember enough about the movie to... Because he, he just sounded way more verbose than I remember him being. Like, I remember him being pretty silent. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so that that's what I'm... Now, I don't know if that's something that's developed in... I don't know, Wake 2 through 4, 5, I don't know what, it's, something else is coming out now. I don't know where we are in this series, but I don't know if he talks more and therefore you see that he's... Far more intelligent than... Right. Because, again, he's coming in and saying something here that sounds way more intelligent. 
maybe it's just putting him beside these two. Right. Who knows? Oh, <clears throat> oh your pals in the Taliban help you write those. Those were Mujahideen. There's a difference. The Taliban formed in the 90s when you fell off with a vengeance. Hey, who the fuck asked you, dog pal? Don't you go lock your mouth in a hole in the ground? You're both a funeral suit away from presentable. I'm thinking I'm bad, and I'm thinking you're expendable. You wanna die hard? <laughs> Today's a good day. Let's go, motherfuckers. You be kind. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Yay, thanks to all the Patreons! That was definitely fun. You guys keep the ERBs coming, and we thank you for it. Nuts! <laughs> what? Nuts! No, I thought it also said something. Nuts! Oh, thanks for watching. That was funny. Alright! I did like the Expendables reference at the, the end there. That's good. Um, it was a good rap battle. It and is, I did like the Yippee Kaye. Like, it had to kind of end that way, I feel. It was, honestly, though, nowhere near my favorite. Again, though, it was dealing characters. with three characters that I just... Yeah. Um, it, it was, I mean, the way they put these together is so fantastic. Yeah, they always do a and fantastic And they really... Job tried to nail their voices at, in so much as people who are not those actual actors can. Right. Um, looks wise. Again, I, I still feel like McLean is the only one. There were a few. Like the decent dad from Rambo. Um, there was another one from Wick that I thought was a, a, an actual Look. burn. <sighs> Hands down, I gotta give the McClane. win to McLean. Yeah, I feel like he had the most savage bars. Well, that's what I was just getting at. Is like he's the only one that I felt actually had constant burns. Right. And like actually low blows, not the sort of generic "you suck." Right. Yeah. Um, and like I said, it was a, it was a good rap battle. Again, just not characters. If you guys are wondering. I pretty much only watch horror and Marvel movies at this point. Well, and then like all the um, forensic shows and, and forensic veterinary shows. shows like, and that when I, I go to action, if I want to watch action, it's usually the Bourne movies, um, Boondock Saints. I watch a fair bit. Um, I like I like a, a good I assassin. I like a good vengeance. Yeah, um, retribution. But no, I pretty much just stick to horror and Marvel at this point. Um, you also don't have that much downtime. No. So there is that. No, I don't. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so pretty decent. Uh, can't wait for the next one. Me neither. ERB always does a fantastic job. And honestly, this is great fun for three characters that are sort of... Again, I like McLean, but I'm not giving him the win simply because I prefer Die Hard so far. No, like, I was, I was rooting for... I wanted <laughs> Rambo to win. Well, I, that's what you said. I like Rambo more than the other two, but I love how they presented him though. That was fabulous. <laughs> <clears throat> well, and then his little flashback at the end there with whole locks. It's like, uh oh. Uh, anyways, <laughs> all right. So if you like the video, slash that like button, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. Comment down below. What did you think of Epic Rap Battles of History with John Wick versus John McClane versus uh, John Rambo? John Rambo. Also, comment down below if there's anything else you guys want to see reacted to. Check the description below for all things. Push our buttons. Come join us on our other social media platforms, mostly Twitter, if you want a quicker response. With that being said, we love you guys. Thank you all for watching. Cannot wait to see the brave people later.